Hello friends, my name is Prasad and welcome back to Adda Desi. In today's episode of Unicity Live, we are going to talk about a Unicity which was requested by many of our subscribers, that is San Francisco State Unicity in California. But before we move forward, let me get done with my usual request. If you like the work we do, then please consider subscribing to our channel. This is completely free for you guys, but it will help us a lot with the YouTube algorithm and it will keep motivating us to make such informative videos in the future. Also, subscribers can comment below which university they want me to cover next and I will surely make a video on that. Now that aside, let's start with the application requirements. There are total 6 application requirements in San Francisco State University. First, an online application that cost around $70. Second, academic transcripts. Third, two letter of recommendations. Fourth, a statement of purpose. And fifth, GRE score. And sixth, English language proficiency test, that is your IELTS, TOEFL or PT score. Minimum English score requirements are as follows. TOEFL, 80, IELTS, 6.5, PT, 59 and Duolingo, 120. San Francisco State University has an acceptance rate about 84.1%, reflecting a lightly selective admission process. Next, let's talk about the graduation requirements and the tuition fee structure. I'll take a computer science course as an example to talk about the graduation requirements and the tuition fee structure. If you need specifics about your program, you can comment below and I will definitely reply to that. To complete graduation, one needs to complete at least 30 course credits. This can take at least 18 months or 4 semesters. Total tuition fees to complete this 18 months of course for an in-state student would be around $15,414. And for an out-of-state or international student, it would be around $27,294. There are additional fees such as health insurance, campus fee and other service fees which may cost around $2,000 more. One thing to note here is that this is just an estimate and tuition fees keeps on changing each semester. Next. Let's check out the housing costs. But before that, if you haven't already liked our video, then please smash that like button. Off-campus housing offers affordable options, so many graduate students prefer off-campus housing. You can visit our website addadc.com and find many such off-campus housing options. The average rent for an entire two-bed, two-bath apartment could start around $2,600 and go up to $3,500 per month and the average rent for per person is around $1,300 to $1,700 per month. Average monthly utility bill is around $160 to $180 per person. You can also join a special Facebook housing group for San Francisco State University and connect with other international students. The link is in the description below. Next, let's talk about transportation. Students can use free campus shuttle or discounted public transit bus using the student ID for off-campus transportation. The nearest international airport would be San Francisco International Airport, which is just around 9 miles from the university. Next, let's talk about on-campus jobs. San Francisco State University has an online job portal for on-campus job application. You can apply directly in the portal using your resume if even before you start the semester. International students can work 20 hours per week during fall and spring semesters and up to 40 hours during vacation periods. Average pay at this university could be around $16 to $20 per hour. Certainly, there are some pros and cons of pursuing a master's degree at SFSU. Some of the pros for an international student are as follows. First, location. San Francisco is a vibrant city with a diverse culture and numerous professional opportunities, particularly in technology, business and arts. Proximity to Silicon Valley offers unparalleled networking opportunities with tech companies, startups and industry leaders. Second, tuition cost. SFSU is more affordable compared to other universities in the Bay Area, especially private institutions. Third, diverse com campus life. A diverse student body with various cultural and social perspectives 
robust support services services for students including career services counseling and academic advising on the other side there are some cons too and they are as follows first cost of living san francisco has a very high cost of living which can be a significant financial burden despite relatively lower tuition fees second resources and facilities as a public university sfsu may face funding constraints that can impact the availability and quality of certain facilities and resources compared to wealthier institutions third reputation sfsu may not have the same level of national or international prestige as other universities in the region which might affect perceptions in certain professional circles choosing to pursue a master's degree at sfsu depends on your individual goals financial situations and the specific programs you are interested in the university offers many advantages particularly for uh, particularly for those looking for to benefit from its location and diverse academic offerings however it's essential to consider the high cost of living and how it aligns with your financial and professional plans remember that individual experiences can vary so it's a good idea to reach out to current students or alumni to get more detailed understanding of what to accept expect at the end as always i would like to wish you all the very best for all your future endeavors please like subscribe and comment to our channel and also don't forget to follow us on facebook and instagram using the link in the description thank you